Good morning, everybody from the Magic Kingdom. How many times we've heard that this week, right? <laughs> it's all right. I'm not even mad about it. I'm excited for today. Why? Because one, we got that castle right there looking pretty. But number two, there's nobody. I mean, compared to the last week we've had here, it is an empty day. There is, it feels like nobody's here today. I know that just, you see a lot of people, but coming into the park, parking, walking in, it's going to be a great day. I'm excited. We're going to go ride Big Thunder right now. Yep, we're going there right now. That's, that's what kind of day we're about to have. We're about to have the wildest ride in the wilderness. <laughs> so good morning, everybody. Beautiful out. Weather, perfect. Crowds, perfect. It's going to be a perfect day. Perfect day on a Friday. We can show per Friday. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed today's stream, don't forget to hit that like button. Let us know you enjoyed something you saw here today. Of course, subscribe to the channel right here as it is free to do just like the giveaway in the description below enter yourself a chance to win some free stuff thank my moderators for moderating my wonderful wife for doing all the wonderful wife things she does my uh patreon members and channel members again for all their continued support and if you guys are looking to book your next trip to a beautiful day like this here at the magic kingdom check out travel with angela in the description below she is here to help you book that trip to wherever you are trying to go. It's so nice out. And we got Jessica here. Hello, Constantine, Kevin, Roy G. Yet it is. But like I said, we're going to head on over to Big Thunder this morning. As you can see, it's, it's just so much nicer out. Parking, everything, just so quick today. Who else we got? Roy G, Constantine, Kevin, Betsy, good to see you. Marcy, CYL, good to have you. Jaslyn, Love Pugs, b -tome. Sunshine, Debbie, Spaceship Earth, Harry Potter Kid, we got Scott. Just met Kyle R. That was super cool. Scott right out. Hello. We got Sandy here. RGSD. Look at this empty. It's like. It's so. Crowd levels are so unpredictable now. Like, there's no way I would have known coming here on a Friday after having the crazy week of people, do you just walk around into this empty park? Emptier than normal. Alyssa, hello. I bet this is the year of weekends are empty and weekdays are busy. Where like last year. Maybe, we'll see. We'll know later this year. The jukebox, hello, just found a channel, Ron G. Uh, yep, we go to the park daily. Karen, hello, good morning. I mean, look at this. This, this is not crazy from yesterday. <clears throat> well, I think it's a com combination of the bands, Dream Academy, and all the other things that were going on. Like all my friends from out of state were here yesterday too. Good to see you Dennis. David S in SC, hello, welcome. We got Lollipop in the morning. I mean, we aren't even trying to go around people it's just it's, it just smooth the day the whole way in we got jasmine over here just walking around
Craig Robotics is in the haunted queue right now. Awesome. Hippie Mama. Let's see, we got Hippie here. Hello, EH, good to see you. Yes, definitely, definitely a huge difference. Crazy what 24 hours can do at this place. Exactly, yet it is. The weekends are empty. Well, a lot of people use the weekends to travel too, so they don't really tend to go to the parks on the weekends when they travel. We got Chris here, good morning. Disney escapades with Tim, good to have you. Nothing going on over here. Just some boats. Oh, there is a lap bar. I can't remember if there's a lap bar or not. On the one over in Disneyland, uh, Disneyland Tokyo, there's like individual lap bars. They're a bit tight. Constantine. I know, that's why we're coming to Big Thunder now. I just have a feeling that if we don't do Big Thunder first thing this morning, after we've been trying for like a week. <laughs> it says 50. I don't see it being 50. I feel like 50 seems a bit long. Ranger P got 60 countdown, awesome. We got Pirates here, good morning from Maine. We're digging out from the snowstorm, oh my gosh. We got Lego building sets, good to see you Jack. Jarrock, hello, good morning. Shooting star, good morning. How you do it? You just <laughs> They're all gonna get a surprise up top when they realize they got a scan again. <laughs> it's there, Dennis. It's definitely there. Hold on. Getting a bunch of emails right now. I mean, it's gonna be the most crowded DVC area. I don't know. It's cool they're doing it, but at the same time, Magic Kingdom's always so busy, unless that thing's. It's bigger, bigger than the one at Epcot. It's going to be crowded all the time. So, we got Kyle R. Kyle R. says, great meeting you this morning, Ron. Nice to chat. Keep up the great streams that can come back to Disney. Have a monster on me. Oh, thank you so much, Kyle R. It was good seeing you. Uh, I just mentioned to everybody when we first got in that I uh, met Kyle R before we went into the park. <laughs> so thank you so much Kyle R and it was good to meet you too.
I'm glad you enjoyed them, Jessica. Thank you for being here. We got Jonathan K. Found it. Oh, okay. I was just about to link it to you. <laughs> It's a tad bit on the sunny side today. It's hard to read. There we go. Jason, hello. Jess, good to see you. X Infinity Zero, good morning. Paul, hello. Good to have you. Uh, sorry, I'm doing good. Doing good. We're going to ride Big Thunder Mountain in a minute. Or in a couple minutes. It might be a little more than a couple minutes, but as, as our good friend Wayne says, I got to stand somewhere. So this is where we're standing right now. Karen M, good morning. Next Friday, heading to Disney. Very exciting. Justin Frank, Mark Vuka. Always good to have you guys here. Oh yeah, I know Betsy. Everything here today has been like even Peter Pan's in the 70s when I came to the park, and then 35s, 50s everywhere. Yeah, it's it's completely different now. I spit it with the 141 to go. Jeremy Heath, good to have you. Chopper Matt, hello, good morning. Look at Broccoli Hill over there. Look at all that broccoli. Get your thrills on Broccoli Hill. Let's see, who else we got? Uh-huh. Who else we got here? Oh, I'm Jonathan Dennis. Dennis is it. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Had <laughs> a poo making party last night. <laughs> That's awesome, X Infinity. Adventures in Wonderland, hello, uh, Weberland, hello. Oh, banana bread. Oh my gosh. After making that last night, I'm about to like. Shelly's about to hate the house since I'm going to make that all the time. Going around, what are the chances of... Um, I don't know. Every Monday, uh, the parks are just busy in general because everybody goes to Magic Kingdom on Monday. It's Magic Monday. It's Magic Kingdom on a Monday. That's really what people do. Like, I'm not joking. When my friends talk about booking trips out here, they're like, we really want to go to Magic Kingdom on Monday. You know, start the week off with, you know, Magic Monday. And I'm like, you and everybody else. Not every Monday is bad. Not, not saying that at all. But I'm just assuming, um, assuming, right? Because the last four and a half weeks or five weeks or whatever, uh, besides that one random week where we had no crowds for a week, when my son was on vacation, uh, it, oh, and annual pass holders, all annual house holders are back open on Mon uh, Sunday. So I just have a feeling that Monday is going to be pretty busy. Hey, Ron, good morning. Thanks. Oh, no problem, Jamie. Glad you're here.
Oh, that's awesome. Todd and Laura, uh, Laura Lori, sorry, Lori, uh, get ready for our first cruise in on the Dream in May. That's exciting. Yeah, no, that didn't make it into the film. Emma, good to see you. Uh, so good morning, Ron. Have a magical Friday. Thank you so much, Emma. Hope everything's going good with you. I still have you. Yeah, so Emma, before you leave or before you go, um, Emma's one of the uh, one wonderful friends we had on the channel. Actually, gave us. I'm pretty sure you remember this. <laughs> it's on my keys. It says. May you be proud of the work you do, uh, the work you do, and the person you are, and the difference you make. So, uh, we have Shelly has one on her keys, and I have one on my keys. So again, thank you so much from you and your family. Morning, Megan G. Lucky dude, good to see you. Tyler, good to have you. Tink for life. Yeah, this is moving pretty quick. Either way, I want to ride the wildest ride in the wilderness. Username profile, good to see you. Angela. And Timothy coming in from Michigan. Those streams are always obviously scheduled kind of random due to the fact that Shelly would just be like, I, I, I think I want to do the candle one again. I'm like, okay. Lauren says, can't wait for Chiana's Bayou. Kristen, hello, welcome. Eh, eventually, it'll open one day. We'll be there for it. Do you accept the lunch? No, I'm pretty good. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty, I, I make sure to eat and everything prior to coming to the park. Michelle coming from Brazil, welcome. Mitchell, thanks for being here from Brazil. Adam the Who, welcome. We got artists here. Theme parks assemble. You doing good? I know she hasn't been live in two weeks. Everything all right with you? Clint, good morning. Lauren, hello. 232 Melody. Morning from St. Louis. Second, Zoe, Maddie, and I will be there in about three weeks. Three weeks. Okay, gotcha. No, no, I, I watch everybody. <laughs> it's just. It's not a joke when I say I watch everything. I watch everything. Like, I know Fantasmic was canceled last night. Living in Detroit, we got Sean here. I was one of those people. Gail, good to have you. Uh, living in Detroit, I was the same way. I'd always be like, if I went to Disney today, what would the crowd lights be like? If I went to Disney, like, you know, and I've, I always had those questions myself. Like, if I went and scheduled a trip like I planned, what would I be dealing with right now? You know, you got Ashley says, was there last week coming in December? Cannot wait. Not a problem, Ashley. Glad you're enjoying it. Uh, 
Uh, I will be going to D23 in uh, August. <laughs> uh, just for one day on that Saturday. I can't go Friday, so there's no point in buying a ticket then. And uh, I'll be in the park Sunday, so. Because we're magic key holders. Boogie down. Good morning, Ron. Thanks for the stream. We work from home and always have your stream on all day. Thank you so much, JBB. David's here. This is Hiram bringing in Pittsburgh to the chat. Let's see. We got Pittsburgh now. We got people from Washington. We got Ariel here. Hello, welcome. Can't wait to see the D20. <laughs> I don't know if we're live streaming D23. I think we're just going to vlog it because um, with that many people in the area and everything, I'm not sure it's going to work. I don't want to have to worry about signal and everything. And it's my first time going to D23 also. But we'll see. We'll see. Ariel, hello, hello. Running joke. Yvonne coming in from Tallahassee. Ooh, that's awesome, Megan G. We, me, and Coda are going to try to live stream the at least the parks announcements from the Honda Center. Or we'll see what happens with that. You can ride water parks at any time, but it won't change your start date of your pass. So if you want to add water parks today, um, it's still the same price and everything. There's no prorated rates or anything like that. You just uh, pay it and then start going to the water parks. Chris Cannon! Look at all that gold. I mean, could you imagine that? 24 ounces per ton. Like, I watch Gold Rush. They get like, not even an ounce per ton sometimes. Disney trash can. What's going on, trash can? <laughs> It's so nice, and, like the weather out today, the breeze is amazing. It's just, I woke up this morning going, yes please. Oh my gosh. Mr. Joshy, good to have you. And we got Helen here, good morning. Let's see how this is. 
Johnny Five, good morning. Hey. Not much to see down there, huh? Uh, Oh, that's awesome. All day tower on May 1st. Uh, Daryl Howe enjoyed the candle making last night. Yep. And all those candles we made last night, you all bought up already. So, <laughs> I already got to make more. We literally ended and ordered more jars because that's how many people ordered last night. Now the wait time for the ride when we got in line was 50 minutes. I said, no it's not. So we're here to find out. Since we've only been live for 28 minutes, it's looking pretty good. Hello Soren. Welcome. Who else we got here? I hope it doesn't. I hope Genie Place goes up in price. This is a roller coaster, yes. I hope it goes up in price and less people buy it. That's personal. Got Samantha here, welcome. Mike Smith. It's the Wobble Shop. Pickles is here, David Johnson. So, we're not here to make a debate about bring back Fast Pass, it's never coming back. Unless they can't get people to attend the park, Fast Pass isn't coming back. Everybody's willing to pay for Genie Plus, so ain't no reason to change a business model that makes a profit. Move by. Me tell him that's hilarious. I don't know, two or three more times. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of the current test track anyways, so I'm excited for the change. No, no, you can love Genie Plus, and I, I again, use it away. You can't get park expansions and new rides and re-theming and stuff without the funds, right? You need capital to make those changes.
<laughs> yeah, no. That genie plus for, uh, is paying for all the wonderful things we can't wait to have. Do you think sixty billion dollars is just going to pop up and and park tickets? No, you got to find another revenue source. Genie Plus is that revenue source. Ernesto, hello, welcome. And we got Washington Caps, and we miss living so close to Disney. Jordan, have you? Let's see. I honestly think they should raise Genie Plus to sixty dollars flat across the board. Make it park hopper option without having to make it a park hopper option. Just one flat rate. Use it any park you go to, park hop or not. The thing is, when you tier your ticket prices, like they do with Animal Kingdom, prime example, uh, it tells people that that's the least valued part. Right? If you charge less. To go to Animal Kingdom, you charge less for Genie Plus to Animal Kingdom. People naturally will be like, well, it must be the less valuable park to go to. It's a business. I mean, like, oh, Magic Kingdom, it's the most expensive park to go to, and it has the most, must be the better park to go. Let's go only to Magic Kingdom. Playing Dream Valley right now. Well, thanks for being here. The Disney Baker! Hey, what's going on, Disney Baker? It's like when you buy something. You can get this model, which has rides and shows and stuff. Or you can have this one, which has ride shows, parades, fireworks, and everything else. So yeah, naturally people are gonna be like, well, I'm gonna go with the more expensive option. It's not much more expensive, but I get almost twice as much entertainment. It's hey, Tracy, me. We don't do like boardwalk days. We go to the boardwalk, but we're not gonna spend a whole day out there. Yep, and then MK or AK closes earlier. Why does Animal Kingdom close earlier? One, all the animal areas are closed. And number two, uh, there's no nighttime show of any type. It could be a water show, it could be anything. You can make World of Color 2 at Animal Kingdom. We would love it. We would love it. Yes, I'm very excited for the new test track. If the imagery of what they've been posting is going to be what it is, I'm... I I do want... Oh, you know what? Okay, here's what's going to happen. I don't know if we can do it this month. We might have to do it next month. But we're going to do an all-day test track. That way, when they reopen test track, we can do an all-day test track. Uh, not anytime soon, Mr. Joshi. Oh yeah, no, I definitely, I definitely do a, um, a world of color at uh, Animal Kingdom. I'd be down. I could totally stick it out for that. That would be cool. Something like it. It doesn't have to be like World of Color. It could be their own variation. This is fine. Uh, but you already have the amphitheater seating, right? You have lighting. You have to add, modify lighting and stuff. But so we'll do an all-day test track soon. That way we can uh, do the 
current version and then it'll do the mod the newer modified version. That day will be so full of lag, it'll be crazy. Hey April, good to see you. And yeah, I don't either. That's most of it's a lot of not sleeping. I'll sleep another day, but but right now I don't sleep. Oh, the weather is great today. Compared to Tuesday, this is wonderful. Nancy, good to see you. Let's see, Justin Coe's here. I think Test Track's down for a good lengthy amount of time. It's crazy. Test Track's only been like in this new version, I think, what, 2018? October 2018. And uh, it's when they opened the current version of Test Track. And now we're going to get a new. version of Test Track again. Literally, Test Track is going to change three times before we get a new festival for Fantasy Parade. Travel. We got Kay here. Good morning, Con. <laughs> hey, what's going on, Streambinder? Um. Well, I don't know where the reopen date for the new test track is. I'm not the center of news and information like that. That's not my job. There's tons of people who can cover exactly when things. A lot of it's always rumored too, right? There's always speculation like, Tiana's Bayou's gonna open on this date. Like, I personally think Tiana's Bayou probably won't open to general until August. It says summer 2023, or 24, not beginning of summer. I think they're hyping everybody up, but at the same time, they're not as far along as everybody hopes they are. Alex, boarding my flight five hours. Awesome. We got from Michigan. We got Epcot for me here. Carly, good from Michigan. Good to see you this morning. Gotcha. 
Well, it took us about 32 minutes to get on the ride. It was suggested 50 minute wait time. Okay, so it's raining in Scotland. Uh, okay. And sorry for the whole rap, folks. There seems to be a slow little train up ahead, so we gotta sit here for a spell. You just remain seated, and we'll be right with you. And sorry for the whole rap, folks. There seems to be a slow little train up ahead, so we gotta sit here for a spell. You just remain seated, and we'll be right with you. Oh, no way. And sorry for the hold up, folks. There seems to be a slow moving train up ahead. So we gotta sit here for a spell. You just remain seated, and we'll be right with you. I'll thank you more, Beverly, please. Glad you enjoyed it. it off and turn it back on method. Yes, New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut just had a earthquake. It's the faded pirate shirt, exactly. I have an evac shirt. Yeah. More Beverly, please. Lily's called. I'm here for the evac. That's why it's a little bit of 
Yeah. No, 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 you're about 20 minutes. Hey, Average Joe, good morning. We got JB here. Train to save, hello, welcome. We are currently waiting for our chant. Nope, that's not what we wanted. Mm. Wow. 4.8 earthquake in New Jersey, wow. Check that out. Thank you, Carly. Oh, I was so close to an evac on Big Thunder Mountain. This is so sad. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, we missed up. We are in the process of getting everybody who is in the queue above you out of the attraction. Once that happens, we're going to have everybody turn around and head up that ramp to the attraction. You will be getting a lightning lane, so please have those park tickets out and ready. As you head up that ramp, there will be cast members at the top to give you a lightning lane. Thank you so much for your patience and cooperation. If you have any questions, please reach out to the I know, I keep getting an almost evac on rides. Ah, no, I'll see you. Um, I'm thinking probably we should go so just a moment, we're gonna use it. People move up the queue. If you could just have those park tickets out and ready, we are going to get Thank to the you. lightning lane since you are about to get on the ride. Okay. Thank you. Jump over to Animal Kingdom real quick and use the lightning lane for Triceratops. Then that's a very Janelle thing to do.
Should we use it for Carousel Progress? Small world. Small. We gotta use it for small world. <laughs> Unfortunately, Lightning Lane's only good for certain rides, not all rides. We'll figure one out. It happens. You can't be mad at anybody. It's it's they're running the ride as is, as is manufactured. Sometimes the system goes down. Yeah, it's not like we could do this to go on any ride with this. I think we can only go on like like if we wanted haunted mansion or something like that. We can't go on Peter Pan or Seven Doors Mine Train and stuff like that. What's going on, Travis? I've gotten these a bunch. That's 20 minutes away in here. Yep. RGSD, yes you did. You had your earthquake. Did you have your earthquake tree? I was like, we're going to ride Big Thunder Mountain this morning. <laughs> JK. Oh, man. Every time I try to ride Big Thunder Mountain in the morning, there's always something. Always something. Today, we get to experience the reverse queue of uh, Big Thunder Mountain. That's, that's a first. Oh good, okay, you had your earthquake feet in In Japan, um, a lot of times the winds or you, will be pretty bad in Japan and my building would kind of shake, but it won't shake the tree. And so if you guys ever watch some of my older videos, you'll hear, you'll hear me reference earthquake tree. And uh, a lot of times you'll just be sitting in there and you're like, is the building rocking or we haven't, because if the building's rocking, in Japan, you'll you'll just feel the building moving. But if it's an earthquake, the tree in the room would actually start shaking and bouncing up and down, and that's how you knew it was an earthquake. So I call it earthquake tree. You mean Disney podcast? Hello, welcome. Again, used to be a ride operator myself. There's nothing you can do about the situation. Rides go down. Especially when you run them as long as Disney runs these rides every day, 365 days a year. Like you can't go to Peter. Like you can't go to Peter Pan or Seven Dwarves or anything like that. Yeah. The big fancy rides. <laughs> no, Kimber. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. Do 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 do. You know what? We made it. That was a successful almost evac. Man, we almost got evac. Well, if you guys enjoyed that unfortunate situation, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It happens. I mean, they even shut the water off. Like, the water right here on the, the whole ride shut down. So. We'll go over it in just a minute. Uh, All right, so we have this Lightning Lane experience. As you can see, on Selected Channel. Find out where you can go. You can click find out where you want to go. I'm going to come over here so you guys can see it. So we can do Barnstormer, Big Thunder Mountain, Buzz Lightyear Spin, Dumbo, Haunted Mansion. Ooh, we can do Haunted Mansion. Uh, Mad Cheap Auto, Small World, Magic Carpets, Philhar Magic, Monster Inc., Pirates, Tomorrowland Speedway, Under the Sea. You don't get Bell, Jungle. Oh, man, I want a Jungle Cruise. Um... Peter Pan, Seven Dwarves, Mine Train, Space Mountain, Tron. No, that's weather. 101's weather. Well, we tried. You ever try? I tried. A lot of people still heading to Big Thunder like they're gonna go ride it. <laughs> they don't see. No, everybody doesn't see a line, so everybody's rushing. My daughter. <laughs> We've got Captain Crunch in the house. He's in the house. If you guys are new to the channel, I was in Japan for many, many, many months. Almost two years worth of time. I experienced uncountful amount of earthquakes. Um, I can't even count how many times it happened. And, uh, yeah, drawers open up, buildings start twisting, um, everything starts shaking really bad. I've been on a train doing like 60 miles an hour. The whole train just sounds like a semi truck hit it. It's pretty crazy stuff, but. And, uh,. Yeah, I got to experience all that back in uh, 7.3 was the biggest one I was in. I had a 7.1 when I was on a train, or a 6.9 on the train, and a 7.1 in my 2020, 20, or yeah, 21, and then 2022 I was in a 7.3. Um, no, the only tsunami warning I've ever gotten while I was in Japan came out of uh, that volcano eruption all the way down in the South Pacific over by Australia. That was the only time I ever had like a tsunami. Most of the times it was just like warnings, like stay away from the coast. Um, but no, we never had any tsunamis. And then you get used to them. I know that's weird to say, but you do. I'll never forget the morning I woke up. This will be before like forever in my head of the morning I woke up and I was like in the bed and I was just like, it was 
My alarm just went off. I shut it off and I'm like, I am so tired today. I do not know if I want to go to work. And literally like a minute later, because my bed was on wheels so it's easier to clean because you get a lot of dust over there. It's another story. Um, and my bed just started going back and forth, side to side. And I was like, I'm seriously having an earthquake to wake me up right now? All right, I'll go to work. So yeah, I had an earthquake wake me up for work one day. It was hilarious. <laughs> we all rolled into work and we all looked at each other and like, so y'all woke up the same way we did? Yep. Okay. I remember one week we had an earthquake every day. Like, it was just like every 16 hours we had an earthquake. They're like fours and stuff like that, like 4.3, 4.8, 4.2, 4.6. They're all fours. Oh, I think I can make it. Nah, we won't make it this way. Darn. We'll go this way then. Yeah, I remember my initial earthquake was like, it started out at 6.5, it stopped, and then it escalated up to a 7.1. When I had the big one, I was like, oh, okay. Good evening from Tanzania, welcome. I painted boats and ships. Guess what, Japan has a lot of boats and ships. Quick, change the channel. You sweetheart. Oh, Brent, how are you? I'm good. Well, it's almost a thumbnail. The horse is facing us this time. Doesn't see the massive horse walking right at him. Love you too. <laughs> All right. Well, since today is just going the way it's going, we're gonna watch Grayson. It's Friday. Grayson's here. Yeah. Um, somebody was like, hey, you should probably get this job. It pays this much. And I was like, okay. And that's how I got that job. And then I did it for the money. And then um, I wasn't happy. And I did it for like eight and a half years. And after getting passed up for promotion to some things that happened with other people, I was like, okay, I'm done. I'm going to go do something else. And they're like, where are you going to go? And I'm like, I'm going to go to YouTube. And they all looked at me and laughed. <laughs> I laughed too. I was with them. I'm like, this sounds so stupid. And, uh, well, here we are today. I'm still laughing at myself. 
Thank you. Yep. I mean, what are you trying to eat? Sit down and meal. Oh, I, I mean, if you want the food quick but still sit down, Harbor House. Good. They got shrimp, chicken tenders, um, fish. Fi yeah, fish. And then uh, if you don't want that, they have other things too. But uh, the, all the seating there, all indoors, air conditioning, comfortable. Um, no, we ain't got to worry about the heat today. Gonna get I know, it's nice today. <laughs> I'm loving today, man. Tuesday here was. Yeah, a couple days ago, too. Yeah, yeah, it was hot. Now, if everything worked out the way it's supposed to, I'd be living in Japan right now and been there for almost two years. But that didn't work out that way. Hello, good sir. I'm here for you. Tragedy. What? Tragedy. What? What happened? I don't see it. Somebody got ketchup on my stool. What? Where? Right there. On the corner? <laughs> oh my gosh, this guy. <laughs> Is this all you guys drinks? Yeah. Okay, I'll just make it sure. No, you didn't. How you been? Good, how about you? Uh, I just got removed off of uh, Big Thunder, it got shut down. Uh -oh. We were like two away from getting on the ride and they were like, rides down. Oh, so, things happen. There's always next time. There's an earthquake up north in New Jersey. Oh, wow. 4.8. Everybody's all talking about that right now. You were here yesterday, right? Yeah. I've been here all week. The, the Dreamers Academy? Yeah, I, I, I caught it. So I remember that from last year. Yeah. Yeah. I love the, the blinking eye Mickey walking down. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Did you watch the whole thing too? Yeah. They yeah. came right after uh, one of my sets. Oh, that's so I, awesome. I the Dreamers Academy. And they're like, dip in. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is nice. That looks like a fun time. It does. I snuck back there while they were filming in that area. How you doing? Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh man. Stay in your box.
like to hear? The um, birthday song, yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, my 
My wife's schedule doesn't allow me to go anywhere between Wednesday and Saturdays. Hoop de doo, my guy. That's awesome. Which is uh, Thursday. Is it a Thursday? Thursday? Oh my gosh, that's the show they got over at uh, Four Blues. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a dinner dinner theater type show. Is it so, all you can eat kind yeah, of thing? It's yeah, it's, it's all you can eat. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's been going since uh, Forever. 1970. Yeah. When they built Fort Wilderness, yeah. Over 50 years now. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. I'm surprised that nothing changed about it either. I mean, there's little changes, pretty, but like, yeah. Well, except the, the people playing in it. Oh, sure. That would be a little fun. Wow, you opened the gate today. Wow. I know. Wow. I, I'm minding my manners today. <laughs> Grace, I'm so good to see you. Listening. Yeah, no, it was wonderful. I loved, loved you playing the last one. Right there. I was playing with the Phantom. Oh, that's a fun song. Right, so. I'll catch you later. I have a random for sure. Bye. All right, everybody, that was Grayson. Starting to get a little busier, but not too bad. We're still able to walk around pretty easily. Oh we're definitely, as soon as the parade's over, we're going to get on some rides. We are, we are already going to ride a ride today. For those who are just joining us, thanks for being here. If you guys enjoying today's stream, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. It's free to do. And enter in that giveaway in the description below. That's also free to do. Don't need to be subscribed. Nothing. No channel membership. Nothing like that. Just enter an email address, a name. Click two links. One to Instagram. One to, one to my website. You don't have to like anything. You don't have to do anything. Just open and close them. Get yourself some entries. And Monday, we'll give away some free things. And then, uh, yeah, subscribe to the channel. And the more people subscribe, the, the quicker we'll get to the next one. We, we're still, we just recently ended the 30,000 subscriber one, and we're already in the 2,500 one already. Oh, cool. Four minutes. That's perfect. What's up, brother? It's like you knew I'd be here or something. <laughs> I came out anyways. <laughs> How you doing today? Yeah, it's good to see you. Um, that was the, the latest hand. No, no, no. Dude, oh. If you come in like this, and then you do this, rock, paper covers rock I want. Just do that to people next time it happens. I was, I was like, that's the latest handshake. <laughs> I didn't know where I was going. I was like, no, we're going to start over. We're start over. <laughs> Never happened. How's the day? Good. Man. It's, it's good. nice out today. Oh, man. Yeah, that drive in with the windows open. Are you on the bike? Huh? Oh, no. Oh, okay. I figured you'd. you'd... I'm way too poor. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh. I'm sure it's what you have. No. <laughs> Grab an example of what I'm getting ready to do here. Bear Ooh, with me. Yes. I was gonna do like the fan of white, and I'm like, it's not up there. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Ooh. Ah. Oh. All right. So if you guys look at that pumpkin, it's gonna look nothing like that. Um. <laughs> Color-wise, there's not a specific way to make them. Um, I can only make so many pumpkin-colored pumpkins before I scream, so I like some Italian This one's $75. Stuff. Um, I've got this gorgeous, uh, it's one of the rare translucents. I have a lot of transparent colors. I have a lot of opaque colors. Very few true translucents. It allows a lot of light through, but you can be able to read through it, basically. Uh, it's a nice kind of soft rose opaline, which is an expensive way to say pink, I guess. Um, <laughs> got some lilac and some metallics over here and a black for the stem. Uh, while I get going, if y'all have questions about anything I'm doing at all, I don't mind. Ask Ron, he's seen it like a million times. Mm -hmm. No, just shout. Don't yell at him. He's old. Hearing aid has to turn down.
Do you want somebody to go through about the propane bottle? No, I had um, <laughs> an extraney yesterday. He yes. Was a, a torch worker. Yeah. I think out of habit, he turned off every single connection when he shut down. I just realized that. Well, I mean, that does make sense on the torch working side. Yeah, he did. Apologies, give me one second here. <laughs> did he go all the way back? Yeah, that's why I'm like, where? where what? Did he turn it off? Never mind. I remember that Jason did this. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Just use a propane torch? Oh, no, we'll, just, we'll, we'll do it with no torch and see what happens. Oh, okay. Well, why would I need heat? I'm a glass blower. Because. Huh? <laughs> All right. So this pipe is not quite hot yet, but this should kind of take care of that for us. Good morning, salt and sugar and thunderstruck. Good to see you. Shannon Woods. Charlie's gonna make a pumpkin right now. So if you guys haven't seen this guy before, well, you probably should have seen him by now. I've, I've seen him a lot. All right, so everything we make, it doesn't matter if it's an ornament, the biggest base we can handle, they all start the same way. It's just a gather glass. This crucible furnace, think of it like a bowl of honey. It's just a ceramic pot full of glass. I dip and turn, get some of that out of there. So the glass in the tank is clear, right? That colors this heat. I just like getting honey for a cup of tea. I don't get to arbitrarily say, oh, I'm gonna get X amount of glass out of there. You get what you get and the rest pours back into the bowl. So if I'm making ornaments or little cups or something, that's plenty of glass. And anything bigger than that is just a layering process. So I'm gonna cool this off a little bit, get it centered up. I'm just gonna go back, dip it again, and get some more glass. Using what's called a block. It's just a carved out piece of cherry soaked in water. You got this little cell cloth, does the same thing. Uh, let me center it up, and it cools off the outside, but you can see the core is still plenty hot. Get a little bubble started now while I can see. Add some air to that pipe and trap it, that air's going to heat up and want to expand. When that pipe is blocked, that pressure only has one place to go. I said that pressure only there has goes. one. <laughs> One place to go, there we go. Sometimes you gotta mug it a little bit. Alright, so that wood block, even this cloth, it scratches the surface of that hot glass so bad. Just gonna fire polish that really quick. Mm. Alright, who we got here? Let's see. Is today's pumpkin the same size? No, these are the. Uh, you're making the seventy-five dollar size. Making them. Mid mid size. Yeah, that one size. It's like gotcha. like sorting oranges. Okay. I'll, I'll tell you when I pick them. You know what I mean. <laughs> I roll them down this ramp, and it gets wider. They fall into the right basket. You know what I, mean? I mean, you live by the orange field. All right, so this is my favorite step. It's called letting it cool off. Kind of anticlimactic, but I need that to be solid before I go get more glass. That core is too hot and just starts moving everywhere. You know, it's like one day it's raining. I can't find it. Do you organize everything? Yeah, it's all right. Yeah. <laughs> he, he cleaned up for me. I mean, I respect it. I just... Yep. <laughs> Light bulb. A little hotter? A lot hotter. It's okay. really hot. Okay. Really hot. okay. And then 
that base coat I'm using is a very small grain. It's like sand, so it's going to take a couple layers to get the saturation I want. A quick heat. Florida Parks After Dark, good to see you. Get some more. I've done that before. So I've got my accent colors over there. Same thing, just gonna roll right through it. Dave, see? So I start that bubble, pull off the sides, a little more air, pull off the sides. I'm just working that bubble towards the bottom. Is he? Yes. All right, so almost there. Just a little bit of hard glass left on the bottom. You can kind of see that cap. Push that bubble out just a little further. Are you looking for the end of the tube? I'm off some of things, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Probably been standing in the normal parade spot today. Jade, Disney. Um, we're just gonna watch uh, Charlie here make this pumpkin real quick. So you can kind of see some of these colors here. Metallic starting to sparkle just a little bit. Somewhere in the normal spot, right about that area. All right, so I need that shape because luckily it kind of matches the bottom of that hole, which. Luckily, kind of has a um, where the DVC finish. booth is over okay. in uh, Frontierland. So, I'm going to get this bubble, what we call in the glass industry, the technical term is screaming hot. I'm basically going to pour it into that mold, give it a little puff of air. It'll swell up and take those ridges pretty good. Uh, Julia C. Uh, I'm Ron, not Janelle. It's on this I know you guys are watching. Yeah. I'll rewatch the video later. I'll let you know. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how to finish when it kept buffering. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh, Janelle sent you. Oh, we got a package at the store. We got fan mail at the store. I'm gonna put it in the air. Really hot 
not over there, sorry. Charlie. <laughs> the parade's not for like another 30 minutes. You didn't have to play the trumpet. <laughs> So I have to start to delineate an area where I can get that bubble back off to this blow plate. I'm going to cut in what's called a neckline, and it's, it's kind of like a perforation on a sheet of paper-ish. It just gives me a weak spot to separate this when I'm done, or sooner if I mess up. You never know. Uh, that's not how the pipe works. You can't inhale the glass. Not with that attitude. <laughs> Everybody always says don't inhale. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. Everybody always says don't inhale, and I'm like, that's not how it works. Charlie, what happens if you try to inhale on that pipe? Um, nothing. Exactly. Doesn't work that way. Right, so it comes out of there pretty, you know, tube shape, not very pumpkin shape, but. Just rotating this pipe as that glass gets hot, it wants to come towards me and get wider. That's physics, not art. So it's kind of shaping itself up as I work. It's been a while since I've seen you not use the blow tube. <laughs> it's been a while since I haven't. <laughs> My lower back's gonna be like, hey, remember that tool? <laughs> yeah. Alright, one or two more of those and we are good to go. Welcome everybody from Janayo. What's that? Who messaged me? No, that's a package. You received a package. We received fan mail at the mailbox. Please come by and get your fan mail. Oh yeah, Janelle. Okay, got it. I'm sorry, I didn't get the notification Janelle sent. That was weird. Oh, there it is. Now it popped up. Justin B, welcome. Boy, she was like, I'm done with animal. We got to pray in 33 minutes, everybody. We got time. I don't need to get that whole thing hot anymore. I'm just going to focus full steam right on the bottom. Just got to give it a place to sit still on the shelf. Y'all had one of these growing up and does the same thing in a glass shop. I just gotta straighten this out really quick here. <laughs> I'm only one gonna laugh about it. I get it. Yes, Janelle does start like almost four hours ago, so I totally get it. Or not four hours ago. So. Alright, so earlier I was saying things like um, I'm putting this line in to separate the vessel from the blowpipe or remove the object, the art, or some kind of bougie way to say break it the right way, because that's what I gotta do. So I need that line to be the weak spot. I'm just making sure everything else is hot. Morning, Will. 
and hey everybody we are Raphael good to see you Betty Black welcome this is uh, Charlie currently over here making a pumpkin he's almost done he's uh, he's haven't been touched so that's really cold steel and that adds a ton of stress for me and a little bit to the pumpkin uh, sometimes not always but sometimes you can break it the right way and the problem I have now is I know it's cold enough to break I just broke it so I gotta run and get that stem made <laughs> was that your run? That's, that's all I got to do. You were killing it. We gather clear. Yes, I did. I guess it does. Man, emotional scars are on the inside. That was just a little bit of crushed black glass. This is what we're going to make that stem out of. Plenty of time. Drop it in the optic mold right there, gives it that cool look. Alright, so the temperature doesn't really matter, it's the relative temperature. If that's too much colder than this, I won't have to tell you, we'll all know it exactly the same time. When it works right, it's 30 years of practice. They shatter, I'm hourly. <laughs> Got a little cold on me, so we'll see. Ooh, there it goes. <laughs> It said not today. Nope. Um, so, if you were here at the beginning, I was like, oh, I'm looking for this tool, I'm looking for that tool. Some of them were related to this part of it, but if you miss the first half, when it works right, 30 years of practice when they break, I'm hourly, it's fine. So, that stem just got a little cold because I didn't have the piece of pipe that I needed. But nonetheless, we'll pick that up. We'll put it in here, and one of those employees out there, their mom's getting a really nice deep pumpkin with a very short stem on it for Christmas. Right. Woo! That's how you almost make those, guys. You, you don't want to clean the end of it up? What's that? <laughs> yeah. You making the next one? She'll do everything. Oh, I'm on vacation. Okay, yeah. So. What? I give and I give. And they, oh, that's your pressure. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Yeah, but he's only like 28. 30 years and 30 minutes when I was like, where's all my tools? I just, I'm so, you know, it's like your garage or anything, your kitchen, whatever, my kitchen, I know where everything is. Yeah. The gentleman that works on the torch, I'm cross trained because so he was making ornaments yesterday. And he's like, I mean, clean and sweep. And I'm like, clean So I got in this morning, I'm like, oh, let's make stuff. And as I started, I'm like, where is this? Where it is, like, I knew where it was. It was under the rag in the corner. Like, and it wasn't a mess. I knew where it was, you know. So I'll find all my stuff, do it again. Stop back by, guys. Okay, we'll do this just correctly. There we go. <laughs> uh, do you take orders? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. How do you do that? Yeah, tell me what you want, what color you want it in. The odds are I don't have it. We go from there. You know what I'm saying? What you guys hunting for? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, oh, yeah. I got a couple purple. I've got, um, you know, the opal purple, I've got a nice transparent, like kind of gray purple. Okay, yeah, I'll catch you later. Oh, Paul, yes, very aware. <laughs> Literally, people were messing each other. We're having an earthquake! Literally, while I was like, oh, okay. Oh. Um, let me know when it's over. Not much you can do once an earthquake starts. All right, pray time. If we're early enough, we actually might catch the band. If I've learned anything from all the earthquakes I was in in Japan, you just gotta wait and assess the damage after.
Well, Main Street's busy now. Man, and what a difference from this morning to right now. So those of you who are joining us right now, thanks for being here. So this morning we went to go ride Big Thunder Mountain. And then uh, when Big Thunder Mountain went down, so we wound up having to change our plan and, well, yeah. We're gonna ride rides after the, uh, the parade. Figured we'll, we'll do the classic pirates after the parade. Yeah, we'll probably use that uh, evac lightning lane for something like uh, Honey Mansion, or if, if uh, Big Thunder opens back up again. Oh, well, we can go over there. Yeah, it's still down. I have a feeling it's going to be down for a good portion. Hey, Project Loom, good to see you. I ran out on the street, half shaved, only wearing a towel. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> now I get you, Adam, up. I remember my first earthquake in Japan, uh, 2018, 17? Well, my first year, 17. Yeah, 2017. First trip to Japan, January, and uh, sitting in my room, talking to Shelly. Uh, right, because they were going to bed. I was, I was awake. It was a Friday night here. It was Saturday morning in Japan. And next thing she knows, she's like, "Are you okay?" And I'm like, "Everything's moving." And she goes, "What do you mean everything's moving?" I'm like, "I think we're having an earthquake right now." She goes, "Seriously?" And like the TV's going rocking back and forth. The heater's making all clicking noises. And I'm like, "Oh, this is this is good." And then, then they start happening more and more. And eventually, you just kind of get used to it. And then the next year you come back and you get new people who go out to Japan for their first trip and they're like, oh my gosh, there was an earthquake. And everybody's just like, yep, yes there was. And I'm like, what kind of razor? <laughs> yes. I'm sorry, that was great. Like the only reason why you really don't get used to them is because they're so random. You never know when they're going to happen, right? That's... Coincidental, she showed up looking like us. Yeah, I mean, I'm actually only getting to the next. Are you? Am I working here? Because she's Wait, it's Friday. Okay, you're here. Never mind. Yeah, I'm a. I've today. Oh, you know, I'm Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah. And Monday, Tuesday. Sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes. You know, yeah. if I'm feeling poor. You need the money. Yeah. What? Oh, is it an 8 o'clock open day? Yeah. yeah. Oh, but that's lightning lane. That's easy. Yeah, it's nice. It's a nice. And I've done it 445. Fancy. I love my opening. Yeah. I love my opening. I love my opening. I love my opening. I love my opening. Are you going to join the Pirates? Yeah, I'm excited. I'm going to Pirates. Oh my gosh. I was talking to Alex over at the People Mover. He's getting moved over to Jungle Cruise in two weeks as well. He's got a week of training, and then two weeks from now, he'll be. So yeah, no, a lot of people move. Oh, hey, sorry. Did you want to be here? Or yeah. Did you normally like I, I, this there? is my usual spot right here. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm well. I saw you. Definitely be in the shade. I'm, I'm good here. Yeah. Yeah. Good to see you. Thank you. Because they have pockets. The women do not have pockets. 
I don't know. There's no reason. I don't know why the women's have no problem. There's no I'm here from Janelle's feed. Ah, oh, well, thank you, North. They look wonderful. They are very slimming, but they have Do no the vests have any pockets? No. No, no, no pockets. No. Yep. I hear, I hear everything's comfortable except the vest. I like the vest. It's like a weighted blanket. Are you guys like excited about the new costume setup that are coming out? I heard about it. Um, I don't know when, exactly what's all changing yeah. for pirates, but I'm excited. Hopefully the vest is a lot lighter. The thing's heavy. Oh yeah, no, definitely. That looks like some thick material. It's, it's like it's okay. okay. Yeah. You want to say hi, everybody? We got Emily here, everybody. One of our cast members from the mansion. Like, comment, subscribe. Whoa! I saw the, wow! Uh, the, wow! The candle Thanks. making last night. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm the yeah we did. We like, just started I think it's illegal doing that. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. So the, the Allie helps us when when we're well, when the camera's on. Allie um, loses. Oh. Really? She loses it. She's yeah. like, she was like, we were like really confused last night. She's never like that. How you doing? What, what's up? Is there what's, what's up? You call? You stir in trouble here, little oh. way? No, I would never do that. I no. Think so. I think so. No, that's why I'm behind bars. <laughs> well, you're from Robinsville, North Carolina. Yeah. yeah. I'm from. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm from. Um, I'm, my, my college is not not far from there. Where is it? Yeah. Like uh, Coley? Oh yeah, Western. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, I've been to Robinson, but I've been in the gorge. Oh, okay. Was, I love. I, I ride. I, I work for the uh, work for the Great Smoky Mountains Railroad trip. Yeah. Railroad trip. Oh. Yeah. 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 Beautiful trips. I yeah. love those. I like it. There. And I'm going back again next year. Uh, this this year, I mean, at the end of when I'm done here with my VCU program. Oh yeah. Yeah. So yeah, that's yeah. So yeah, small world. I know, right? Yeah, you're like the closest person I've met from uh, your area. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, my, my home's in Winston, but uh, my college is my college is still WCU. is still close. So yeah. So pirates, huh? Yeah, I go there all, all the time. You do? Yeah. 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 No, I can't. So the problem is it just cut took completely out on dinosaur. Uh, One time okay. I rode dinosaur, came back, and everybody was gone. That's like our favorite. Oh, really? What? No. It's, it's due to the buildings all made of concrete. I can't get it. If I drop some things, I might be able to, but it's... Yeah. And also, like, a lot of times when we ride that, the cast members don't let us oh, really? hold it. Yeah. Because yeah, when I told him last night, my pirate thing yeah. popped up. He was like, "Oh, Ron goes there all the time." I'm always a pirate. I'm like, "He wears his pirate shirt. He got the pirate shirt." This is the negative. I already been. Uh, we got kicked off of um, Big Thunder earlier. It's down. Oh, it is. It's oh. down. It's been down since 9:30. Mansion line was a little bit. Long. Yeah, it's 9:30 this morning. I got in line, and then pretty much since then it's been down. How are you guys doing? Hey, Sorry, Ryan, how's it going? I'm good. I'm good. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you. How's hey. your day? It's a must to you. Oh, seriously? You don't so have we, to do when that. we sit on our couch in the air conditioning, you're out here <laughs> busting your butt in the floor to eat. Thank you. What, what are you guys? You having fun? Yeah. Who are you excited to see? Are you dressed as Belle? Are you excited to see Belle? Or? We were the other night. Just, oh, Kirk, really? By the way, yeah. Oh, Kirk. <laughs> Minnesota Kirk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know you probably get so many people coming up to you and being like, Ron. Oh, you know, it's crazy. People just walk by and be like, hey, Ron. I'm like, I. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi. Life on TV, real quick. Huh? Can you show her on real? Oh, you want me to? Yeah. <laughs> Evidence you came to Disney World now. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's public. <laughs> yeah, no, I was like, God, I have to buy Rod a drink. He's out here. He never drinks. I don't like. No. Him. Oh well, no. I, I have like so like when I was watching Grayson earlier today. I was drinking water. Oh, you you just sit there. I do it behind. I, oh, you watch out behind you. Uh, I try to do things usually when there's inner th things are going on right, that way. You're just behind the scenes. You're, yeah, you're I always feeling. try to keep the show going more than the, uh, yeah, <laughs> than me over here know, stuffing right? my face or anything. Like, I can't, I can't do it. I can't, I can't even look in a mirror and me put something, I, no. Mm -mm. You don't even eat though. I do eat. You all you don't eat? see it. You just don't see it. Yeah. I, I keep every, well, like a day today, right? today, because I, I have to leave after 3.30. Kids. Yeah, for the kids. Um, I don't eat today. Like I when I came in this morning, awesome. before I get here. Yeah, on twelve-hour days, I'll bring something with me, and then like we'll see Grayson at like five thirty or something. And that's when I. Yeah. 
tell the chat. Now, yeah. now we know, right? Now we now all we know. know. <laughs> What's Minnesota Kirk, yeah. everybody. What's your what schedule for the rest of the week? Are you um, I'm still here tomorrow night. Tomorrow. Tomorrow night. It's Sunday. And then because we we're here Sunday morning, but we got Sunday evening at Universal for the final Mardi Gras. Oh, yeah, yeah that's a 6:15 so parade. Like, maybe oh, okay. Last time running into you, but. Yeah. Hey, that was cool. No, it was very cool. <laughs> Sorry, I know. Hands it was are good work. Hands are all. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, have you ever had one of these? Yeah. Hey. Hey, oh, oh. Oh, hey, Rod. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Uh, if I don't see you again, man, yeah, no, definitely. Play. See you next year. Nice to see you. See you. Bye. He's famous. No, you're Whatever famous. Name. You're famous. Look at that. Nobody even likes me. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> well, that's awesome. There's been a lot of movement lately. Uh, Mackenzie used to be on People Mover. She's on Small World now. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Would you do Small World? I don't think so. Because <laughs> I also think a lot of stuff up there, it's like one rotation. So if you do Small World, you also have to do other things. Yes, it's true. Is a, Peter Pan, um, Small World. Like yeah. Tiki Tree House and all that. That'll yeah. be my next stop after I get Pirates. I would, ooh. But yeah, it's like one big thing. So it's like, uh, I'm literally going to Pirates right after this. Oh, you are? Yeah. And then oh, I'm going like, to use that lightning lane they gave us to go do home Oh, yeah. 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 That's what a lot of people do. Yeah. Well, it's a, it's a pretty good yeah. value, actually. We were only in line for 30, 31 minutes before. Were you seated on the ride? No, we were the next. Like, there was one person in front of me. We were that close. It's like, I was like, so. I know. I haven't worn my EVAC shirt in a while. I feel like I'm supposed to be in the pirates. Because this is made of polyester. And when it's hot out, it's easy yeah. So. The polyester shirts are nice for like when start sweating a lot. What do you say the Grand Marshal's celebrating today? Ooh, um, birthday. Okay. And from the northeast somewhere. The northeast. I said uh, Pittsburgh. Okay, well, Pittsburgh. Oh, you're going. Yeah, you're going that. Specific. Okay. Um, I said Pittsburgh. I'm going Georgia. Okay. Georgia. That's what you yeah. Said? Spring break's wrapping up in Georgia this week, so I'm going Georgia. It's birthday. Ohio. Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> the other day, Chase got both of them. Really? Yeah, Chase got the uh, new airs ready. Yeah, so the first one was a panel from New Jersey, and the second one was like two panels. How you doing, Dole Wolf Donnie? Good to see you. We got. M Look okay, at you'll be Ron and, and Janelle both enjoying the park. Make... Let's see, hold on, let me find some. Hey, Mark. Well, thank you for subscribing, uh, North. Great, I uh, appreciate it, and thank you for being part of here, sending a week there for my birthday. That's awesome, uh, Saddy Gamer Mom. Hello, everyone. Ten more days, too. Awesome. Oh, it's. I was an 8.2 back in Guam. Jeez. Oh, uh, hold on, everybody. I'm going to mute you real quick. He scared her. <laughs> Shaker, you okay? Oh, Shaker says I'm getting out of here. Oh, damn, this place. I literally have the same ones you gave me the last time. It's good enough. I'm going to give you one. Sticker them up. Yeah, give them all of them. My daughter's the same way. 
Yeah, the bears? She still hates any co uh, character in costume. Any of them? It could be a princess, fine. Everything. As soon as, as soon as you stitch everything. But as soon as you have like a regular, yeah. it's fine. Oh. Yeah. My daughter goes in a full panic. For anybody in a costume? Yep. Uh, we'll watch the parade at home on TV. Uh -huh. No problem now, which is good because like a year ago we couldn't yeah. even watch it on Baby the TV. Steps. Baby stuff. Baby stuff. We used to not be able to even watch fireworks on the TV at home. Oh yeah. Yeah. Now we got those noise canceling headphones uh -huh. for her, yeah. and it's helped her a lot. Even though there's no fireworks on the right, TV. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, here we go. I'm gonna be with the uh, blue rope today, so I'll be on that side with the rope. Gotcha. Ah, I got the birthday. But I didn't get the New Jersey part. Wait, I said Northeast. No, that's right, I changed it. New Jersey and 21st birthday. Got it. Should have stayed with my northeast. Yeah, we'll try harder next time. Hi Ron, since we are I'm here every day, I know the sequence of the parade from Brazil. Oh, that's awesome. Hi, Wendell. Good to see you. Woo! Oh, thanks, Kevin Channel. Glad you enjoyed watching us last night. I love having Shelly on the channel. She just not a huge fan of doing it. But last well, night was her idea. To the Magic Kingdom. In just a few minutes, we will proudly present an enchanting celebration in the streets. Our Disney Festival of Fantasy Parade. But first, please welcome our honorary Grand Marshals. Aaron's Birthday Watch from Cherry Hill, New Jersey. Celebrating Aaron's 21st birthday. <laughs> John Day at the parks, what's going on? Uh, happy Friday, everyone. Sally, I'm back home. Oh, that's awesome, John Day. Glad you had a good time. Congratulations, getting over 500 now. There. 
are now five minutes out from the parade everybody go she guys right here for a moment and we are 577 oh wow today has been a great day if you guys got a moment don't forget to subscribe to the channel all right let me turn this there we go put that there let me do this too No. Hold on. Okay, fix it. There we go. And another one. There we go. Well, if you guys got a moment right now, subscribe to the channel. Hey, there we go. Another one. Thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. Thank you. Like I said, we'll be back here tomorrow night. We'll get uh, happily ever after fireworks tomorrow. And on Sunday, we'll be here for Sunday morning as normal. And then Sunday night, we'll be going to Universal for the final, mar final, <laughs> fine the final Mardi Gras. The final Mardi Gras parade over there at Universal Studios for the month. Or for the year. Sorry, for the year. I thought it was on Wi-Fi for a second there. I had to check. Check it out. We got 584. Minus one. <laughs> See, it's free to do. You can unsubscribe at any time. No cost to you. Another one. Another one. Man, my back is shut. All right, let's see what's going on out there. Nothing? Okay, cool. Nothing? to do and we got see sometimes people leave <laughs> bow toes <laughs> look at we'll see north let's we'll see who all subscribed recently chrissy g for subscribing um north charleston hello thanks for subscribing let's see fry food for you that's a cool name i like that one Maybe someday he can sign that. Oh, Ron's. Another one. Oh, we're 12 away from 600. Do we do 600? 11. It's pretty quiet today, overall, in the park. I'm trying to see a big Thunder Mountain open back up or not. I don't see anything yet. Let me look. SoCal Surfer, yes we do. Thanks for being here. No, it's still down. Yeah, we'll do Pirates. And then we'll see if Big Thunder opens by then. If it doesn't, we'll go to Haunted. 
Um, and then we'll just go from there. We'll keep riding rides and stuff until... Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, sometimes uh, rooming... I mean, you can do it if you want to. At any time, you can unsubscribe, and it will t it will go down. This is a live feed of the subscriber count. So yes, when you unsubscribe, it does go down. All right, here we go. Fred's gonna start. Let's do it. And John for Disney has become a channel member. Thank you so much, John for Disney. You greatly appreciate our channel members and and everybody for watching. I'm so sorry, I just missed, I, I don't know why that didn't pop up, I just got it. I got it right here, okay, hold on. I gotta pull my email back open. I was just checking my email on an order and uh, I just saw yours. It says, Ruben, send us a PayPal. Note from Ruben says, more monster fun. <laughs> Thank you so much Ruben, greatly appreciate the, the PayPal and uh, yeah, we gotta get more monster. More monster fun. I got it. I found it. I found it. That was weird. Huh. You said that a while ago. You said that an hour and a half ago. What is going on with it? You know what? I don't even know. What, I don't know.
it's okay. Uh, PayPal locked me out of my account yesterday uh, when people were trying to make orders because it said I wasn't me. So I called the PayPal and they're like, well, is it you? And I'm like, well, I think my name's Ron. Um, at least last I checked and they were like, well, we have to ask you some questions. I'm like, go for it. They're like, sorry about the misunderstanding. I'm like, uh, yep. My name's Ron.
guys doing? We were we commented about being from Pittsburgh earlier to you. All right, everybody, that was a festival fantasy parade. Of course, if you guys enjoyed that, hit that like button and, of course, help us out. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you, boy. Woo! What's going on, CeeLo? See this? It's called the Sun Avoidance Round. By the way, there's seating back here. Most people don't know about. A wonderful spot to chill. Not in the shade. But still in the park. Don't you do it, camel. Don't you spit on me. You thought about it. Time for rides and shows. Well, we did the shows part. Time for rides. <laughs> Linda, hello, Joe Mo, good to see you. Oh my gosh, is that the line for pirates right now? That's insane. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see how long it takes. You know, let's go for it. Let's go for it. I want to know. Because it's moving. It's not like it's not moving. So that's 45 minutes, we'll see. I think... Oh. I got a golden ticket. Oh yeah, this is fine. It looks worse than it is, okay. Hi Ron, we met you in the runaway rail line in October, was uh, asking about how much your camera and batteries weighed. Um, so, when it comes to like vlogging, not live streaming, because that's a different camera, I use a ZV-1. It's a pretty light pocket camera. Uh, I think it weighs like a pound and something with the battery and SD card in it. With the stick, I think it's two pounds total for everything. Um, the gimbal has a pretty big battery in it. The entire handle is one battery. And then on top of that, the phone, and it's a total weight. The, this piece right here, hold on, weighs like a couple ounces. I don't have actual weights of everything. What's the heaviest thing I carry though? Is this brick, which weighs more than my phone and gimbal combined. It has all the different charging ports and everything though, right? So. It's got the S, uh, it's got a micro to charge it. That one weighs, I think it was like two, three, three pounds, I think it was, something like that. I gotta do it again. Yeah, the three is also the lighter of the models, uh, CeeLo. And again, I, I come here every day. So um, I definitely want to carry the least amount of weight possible per day. Um, it depends on the crowds, Caroline, because even though you purchase Genie Plus, it's not like you can just go on any ride whenever. Genie Plus is kind of a complicated system. Because um, 
You can book your, you can buy it first thing in the morning at 7 o'clock and then like you make your first purchase or your first riding lane at 7 and you got to wait till 9 o'clock to make your second one. Unless the park opens at 8 and you're able to do that one at 8 o'clock, then you can make another one. It's possible to do a lot of stuff with Genie Plus, but at the same time, you're on your phone a lot and you got to remember your times. Oh yeah, no, that brick. So I'll stream for 12 hours. And all I'll do is bring this one brick, right? This is 20,000. You can see, I've already used it today to charge the phone once. And, uh, well not charge it completely, but get it charged up. We're at 94% on this thing. If you're with a family and you need a, that one battery will do all day. Like I'm running my phone the entire 12 hours, the gimbal all 12 hours. The gimbal has an eight hour to nine hour battery life if you balance it correctly. And then the phone has a three and a half hour to four hour battery life, which means I'm charging this phone four times in a day and the gimbal at least once. That, that brick is awesome. Oh yeah, no, Janelle did that yesterday. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. Janelle did a Genie Plus day yesterday. The problem is, is I'm not at the park long enough and I could have to leave at any minute's notice. Like, if I get a call from Tanner's school saying, hey, he's not feeling well, I have to leave right now. Right? Well, that's not very good. Especially when you figure out how much that costs. Um, see, today's Genie Plus prices are $39 for Magic Kingdom. So if I spent $40, I get to the park. Let's say I don't even get to the park. Let's say Tanner just doesn't start feeling good as soon as he gets there. I don't get here until almost 10 o'clock, right? And then like by 10 o'clock, he's like, mm, Dad, I'm not feeling well. I need to go home. I'm like, all right, well. Then that, that's it. Um, it depends. I usually do about 40, 40%. 40 because after 80%, the phone goes into uh, trickle charging. Oh my gosh. Shout out to Minnesota Kirk for the Powerade. Oh, so good. The only reason I like this battery is, I'll show you guys in a second. I'm gonna grab my wire, hold on. I love this backpack. I like how I don't have to take it off to reach inside and grab everything. Literally just reach behind me. I'm gonna plug it in right now. Hold on. Trying to do this with one hand. See, that's why we have the rubber bands on the gimbal. Switch hands. All right, so you can see. All right, it's officially charging now. All right. Hold on, it's fluctuating. Three. All right, charging at 9.6 volts at 2.2 amps, which means if I want to get back to 80%, um, I'll probably have to hold uh, have it charging while we're using it for about, what is it? About 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Will give us about 15%. But you also have to remember to think about that. Exactly, uh, Linda. So my, my schedule is really up to what the kids need. Uh, one day Allie was at school and she just, wasn't feeling good and um and then they're like hey so she she'd rather be at home and i'm like all right i'm on my way
Where you at, Craig? Oh, oh, there you are. You said in front of you, and I'm like, I don't see him. <laughs> no, you're good. How you doing? I'm good, I'm good. Yeah. How's your day going? This one's not too bad. Right now, the parade just ended, so everybody from Lightning Lane showing up. But in like 10-ish minutes. Yeah, we're already moving again anyway, yeah. That's why Pirates is always my go-to ride. Yeah, that's me too. Alright, hold on. That's the parade spot. I know you can go to Main Street and then you know it has that Main Street feel and everything, but something about Frontierland and the parade for me is just better. Um, maybe it's the country bears walking around. You get to see the beginning of the parade when, as soon as it starts. Um, you don't have to wonder what's going on. Hey, Tony. And so. I'm also using this time to see a big thunder mountain might open back up because we were there earlier. It's not looking good though. It comes with a post to lean on. Exactly. I get to hang my backpack up. I can put my gimbal inside the backpack loop. And uh, I can set you guys up. I can get things charging. I can do a lot in that one spot. Obviously, we have a lot of cast member friends who are in that spot, too, as well. All right, we were running into Emily. We were running into Ed sometime. Um, Uh, we see some of the cast members, you know, a lot of the cast members in the parade obviously know where we're going to be. Um, things like that. I like sushi. Sushi, sushi. Sushi. Nah, come on, Koda, man. My man Coda got me stuck with that song in my head. I like, I like sushi, sushi, sushi. <laughs> all right sorry all right back to the chat so like i said pirates right after parade has a little delay as you can see lots of people with lightning lane are heading in there right now um it's pretty normal after the parade but we're moving a really good rate Carlos hello welcome and then like after this we'll go ride pirate or haunted mansion we'll do the mansion
<laughs> it's almost over. Magic Kingdom week is almost over. We got two more days after this. We got Sunday or Saturday night, or happily ever after, and then Sunday. Oh. Bad planning on my part, but we'll make it. I just realized what I did. <laughs> eh, whatever. I'll sleep another day. That one day. No, it's not nearly as crowded today as yesterday. for like a day, uh, it really throws me off. Like, like most people would be like, oh, I just didn't go to the park today. But like for me, like a day off is weird. You can ask Coda. Coda's the same way, sorry. Um, like when he went to Vegas, he was like, it was fun, but like, I gotta get back in the park. Hey Tony, good to see you. Hello Craig. <laughs> <laughs> About 25 seconds. Yeah. That's the only way closed captioning works. So there has to be a 20 plus second delay. Yeah. I see after 49 hours of no Disney, they start getting withdrawal symptoms. My kids love this because they get to come to the parks whenever. So when we're not streaming, sometimes Allie will be like, can we go to Mickey's house? And we're like, yeah, we'll go to Mickey's house. I'll bring her out. And, and uh, Tanner will just be like, I'm going to play Fortnite. So Shelly and Tanner will say, hello, me and Allie come and play in the parks and go see the princesses. Princesses. Morning, Ron. After watching last night's candle making, I just ordered the banana scent and the vanilla blossom. Ah, yes. We can't. Uh, those are. Yes, there are some amazing. That banana is like changed my whole outlook on like. I think the banana one might be number number one now. I did not the bops, not yet. <laughs> Old pirate's foot. <laughs> Uh, 
Last night we were just working like Also, uh, you remember I was talking about doing kind of like a roof over the top of the phone, like I was talking about? So, like, if the phone was here, it'd be like a roof over the top. Um, the other good thing about that is, like, when you're on the people mover at night, the lights in the overhead create a lot of glare as the... Yeah, I'll show you. Check this out. I'll mimic it. <laughs> so you get this. Like that. That comes from the overhead lights. If I had the little roof thing, then it wouldn't be, uh, uh, I wouldn't do that while we're on the ride. No, no, no. We're not calling it that. We're calling it ferocious fragrance. Ferocious fragrance. All right, so the phone's been charging for a while. It's now hot. The phone is now hot. Now we're gonna look at this again. As you can see, we've gone down 4%. We're charging now at 9.1 volts at one amp. So once the phone gets hot, you can see the charging rate has dropped. That's why I like this battery, because it tells you that. Other batteries, you just like, is the battery bad? What's going on? This battery literally tells you what's going on. I'll take a picture. Uh, I got your email, so I'll send you a picture later. It's got to be in a certain spot because the uh, if the gimbal rotates, but the I needed to rotate with the phone, not the gimbal. I'll show you, and then I'll give you some dimensions too. What's a scuba diving candle? I, I've never even... Yep, we are aware, Jeff. I'm so excited Test Track's getting rethemed. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really excited about that. Yes, Santa, Theo, Sam, Eagle. Oh yeah, everybody's been in all day talking about it. It's pretty big news. It's not a very common area for it. Oh, I remember that. They would go through the... Uh, Climate change, different or like different climates, like a hot climate, the cold climate. I rode test track back in 2012 for the first time. <laughs> the tenant tweeted out, "I'm fine."
Dang, 05 was the first time on Test Track. Alright, almost on the ride, everybody. Not that bad. And Ryan McCain has become a channel member. Thank you so much, Ryan. Ryan is our newest channel member. Thank you so much, Ryan, again, for being a channel member. Enjoy the splat, good splash of pirate water for me. <laughs> Sounds good, Theo Sam. Eagle. Sorry. And we got Flapjack. Flapjack in the house. Flying all the planes. I would too like to ride a pirate's life for the for a pirate's life for me. For me, I mean. What? I know that was wild. Okay. <laughs> Don't sit with strangers. <laughs> That's a real problem lately. People keep jumping on the boat with other people. Um, never assume that the weather that is posted is ever going to be the weather when you're here. Remember, it was supposed to rain like non-stop on Wednesday, and it didn't rain at all. Okay, good. Hey, FYE coasters, all Please good be here. Later. Boy, there, crew. For your safety, remain seated, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the boat. And watch the two and no flash pictures. Prepare to make sail. Bienvenidos, bienvenidos. Permanezcan sentados con las manos, brazos, pies y piernas. Y cuiden a los niños. But enjoy the ride.
see he's been kind to me. But who can tell what dangers lie on stranger tides? Mark well, my words, we'll meet again for box on the stormy sea. Well, everybody, that was Pirates of the Caribbean. And of course, if you guys enjoyed that ride, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. We are two away from 600. Help us out here. Free to do. Um, looks like Big Thunder Mountain just opened back up. Just checked it. Um, we've got that lightning. Trying to get through the shop is crazy. We had that lightning lane earlier from when we got evac'd off of Big Thunder, so we're gonna go back and try to ride Big Thunder. Today's band is here. That's a big band. That's one of two bands. Okay, so there's gonna be, looks like two bands today. One, two, yeah, looks like two bands today. There we go, everybody. Broccoli Hill. Tiana's Bayou Adventure in Broccoli Hill. Look at all the uh, broccoli. Ten for ten. Oh, thank you, uh, Coven. Zori, good to have you. Had some broccoli for lunch. Don't worry, everybody. One day we'll we'll ride it. Then we'll ride it some more. And then we'll, and then we'll ride it some more. Just like we ride all the rides. Uh, this is the S23 Ultra Samsung phone. And a DJI Osmo um, DJ Osmo 3 gimbal. How to go around. Everything we use is in the description below. The batteries, the phones, the cameras. Yeah, summer is uh, July, August, so we'll see what uh, whatever it winds up being. Chopping broccoli. <laughs> yeah. One day we'll get there. Second time we've been here today. Yeah, I mean, they make announcements and then we'll see how long until they actually do it. It'll be obvious 
When they close the shooting gallery, we literally stand by that spot every day for the parades. Well, not every day, but you know what I mean. The tiny red side. Oh, they get the red wall there? The right side. Yeah, the the little pocket, I see a lot of people use those here all the time. I couldn't even go into my first It depends on if you remember everybody's different some people don't like coming here every day other people do I don't mind coming here every day I still have fun every time I'm here yes everybody we are we're very aware of the drone show epic universe the Tiana's Bayou adventure eventually opening this year uh, the BBC lounge the new expansion over at Animal Kingdom that I'm not hoping, uh, I, I mean, I'm hoping for it, but like, how many times have we heard Animal Kingdom say they're going to do something? And amongst them, many, many other things, including the earthquake this morning in New Jersey. Yes, we are very up to date. I would, be, I would be more excited about the drone show if they didn't choose summer time for it. In summer! Because in summer in Florida, we have lightning, heavy winds, heavy rains, storms. Sunset is about 8 o'clock at night, which is not a big deal. Where we just had like, you know, the last five, six months of light rain, if no rain, no winds, and sunset around 6.30. Gotcha. Woo. I'm still excited to go see the drone foot, you know, the drone show at Disney Springs. I'm not saying I'm not gonna go do it. I'm just uh, surprised they didn't choose the. Uh, the gimbal. Okay, hold on, everybody. Okay, we're good. All right, this is where we were last time when uh, the ride shut down, so we'll see what happens. Best remove them.
I feel I like I felt if we went on pirates, by the time we get off we'd be getting on here, so it was correct. Right in the wilderness. Woo! Yeah, so I was thinking of the same thing, username profile. Um, it's going to be like Disneyland fireworks. And it's not happening. We do pan all the time, as long as it's first thing in the morning or last thing at night. In fact, if you guys joined us Wednesday night, we rode pan as the last ride of our... Uh, Peter Pan is our last ride the other night. We don't do Seven Door Mine Train very often because that line is always insane. Glasses as we move them. Here's the wildest ride in the wilderness. Ah, oh, I got a smudge on my glasses.
All right, well, that was the remake up of the Big Thunder Mountain that we were supposed to do almost two hours ago. So, if you guys, of course, enjoyed Big Thunder Mountain and subscribe to the channel, it's free to do and uh, greatly helps the channel here more than I can ever explain. I get no cost to you. Big Thunder Mountain. Do this all day. Rode this for the first time back in June. That's awesome, FYE coasters. <sighs> do, 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 do. We got people working up on Broccoli Hill. Fireworks. Oh my gosh, that's a crazy line for the train. After the train just left, there's a, a huge line waiting for the next one. Huh. Hey, monks. Oh no, you're all good. We're doing good here. Oh yeah, we call this Broccoli Hill. I know it's not the name of it, but you know, that's what we're calling it. You ever seen the top of, you know, like the stem of broccoli? And then they put all, you know, the big top on it, right? So pretty much that's what it looks like. You got the stem of the uh, the ramp right there and then a big old piece of broccoli just sitting on, you know, like Broccoli Hill. All right, let's go do some stuff. Let's go do some stuff. Hey, Bob G, good to see you too. Hanging out at Town Hall, 1867's where I'm trying to find. Uh, yeah, we we have a park reservation for June 10th for Community like Corps. Uh, we'll be there. Not sure how that's gonna go. I'm pretty sure we're gonna stream's gonna get taken down for whatever the songs they play in the Encanto stuff. But we'll, we'll give it a shot either way. Got it now. Can we or can't we? I'm having a feeling that June 10th is gonna be crazy. Oh yeah, well I'm here all the I'm here pretty much every day, so yeah. I'll be here opening day. <laughs> Megan, hello from Chicago. Frontier Trading Post.
Like I said, it'll be pretty obvious if they ever do anything to this spot. It's pretty in the open. I wonder if they'll bring it out to where the tree is. If they do anything. Everything's always an if. Never guaranteed. There's, that's why it's called a plan. There's a plan. Plans can change. There was a plan to open up a play pavilion at, you know, Epcot. And now I don't think they're doing that at all. Oh, at least I haven't heard anything about it. Seat available. That's crazy. Even though it's it's not super busy, it's still busy here and seating available on Horseshoe right now. Uh, we got Natalie coming from the UK. Hello, welcome. Liberty Tavern. Uh, we went to Tom Sawyer Island once. We were on there for 15 minutes and we were done. No, we don't go to Tom Sawyer Island in here. There's nothing there. I take my kids out there. When we're, like, we're here with the kids, absolutely. They love it over there. It's different, it's fun. It cuts out a bunch over there. Sometimes, not always, but you can't go in the caves. The, even though the barrel bridge is back, they haven't opened the barrel bridge. So they put the barrels back right there, but you still can't go out on it. Should we go for it? Oh, that's a lightning lane line? Looking for the regular line? No, 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 I got you. I was just surprised how long this was over here. <laughs> yeah, we'll come back later. Maybe. That's an crazy lightning lane line. No way, it's a walk on? But, no! I mean, it's like the only walk on available. Hey, 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 Joe, what's going on, my guy? Almost a walk on. It's a small world ride with a small world guide and the name is Hey! Boy, it's so bad. I 
expect a full sing along. Alright. Get me off this ride already. Get me off this ride. It's a small, small boat. And this boat needs space. Now I'm trying to escape and swim away. But I can't because every time I do the dolls look at me. They freak me out real bad. Oh really? When my son was like five years old, this is his favorite ride in the whole park. We rode it 13 times that day. 13 times? That, no, I'm just joking, it wasn't 13 times, but it felt like it for sure. Got it out of his eye. Welcome to It's a Small World. Wait times. Wait times are what's forcing me on Small World right now. This is the best wait time ride. That's a full ride. Have you heard about the time I ran away and the dolls followed me and I couldn't escape it? Now, obviously, it's very busy, and I'm barely holding signal. And, uh, it's normal with small world. It's a small world. It's a small world. We're gonna sing this song and get along, or I'm gonna unleash the dolls on. <laughs> Victor. What a dom bomb bomb bomb. If you can get a song that's timed with the movements of all the dolls and everything, it is so cool. Small World will be a party. Oh, yes, the clock tower. The smiling face that tips back and forth. Yeah, the marching band's at 2.20. We got time. We have a little over an hour, or a little less than an hour. But we'll go on this, we'll come around. We'll go catch the bands on Main Street, which end right before the band show up. We'll do that, okay. There's a plan. We always have families who are watching the marching bands as they come by, so we definitely uh, try to cover that so family members who can't be here can watch. Uh, Jonathan, we already watched uh, Charlie make a pumpkin earlier. We're about to go on this ride and we hope it lags out. Don't forget. To subscribe on out. Did we had 600 yet. 
Do we do it today? Hey! 603! Boom! Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, it's free to do. And enter that giveaway down in the description below. Here, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Alright, so here we are. We're watching that guy. Um, that's a really cool photo, by the way. Just took it yesterday. Alright, we're gonna click this. He's got information right there. You're gonna see that link. It says right there 32.5. You're gonna click said link. Boop. It's gonna load. Now, obviously, I'm already logged into the Entry Ever giveaways and other websites and stuff like that through Gleam. So, I'm gonna click the website and the Instagram. You don't have to have an Instagram. Just click it, close it, open the website, close it. You can look at our candles if you want. You don't have to. Anyway, those go away. After that, you'll have two entries. Oh, we're gonna get stuck in the last room for a while. But they have to empty out that boat. Is this real life? Yeah, when I looked at the line for everything else and I looked at this line, I was like, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. Well, thank you. Yes, I love the back row. Thank you, Sir Crunch Man. All right, everybody, we're about to small world this thing up. This is happening. Twice in one week. It must be a Friday. Is it that time already? Yeah, we got 50 minutes until the parade. Or not the parade, the march, the marching band, so we got time. All right, let's go. Ah. Ooh, Into the cave. Into the unknown. Small world.
seated until your boat comes to a complete stop at the dock and you are asked to disembark. Daylight is not a myth. I've seen it. Oh yeah, I guess. Small world. Small world. Small world. Now. We made it. We did it. We did it. Oh my gosh, we were on there for 15 minutes. You all stuck it out for 15 minutes? One forty five. Hey, Vicky. Well, there we go. Two times in one week, the world is broken. And that line is so much longer now than when we got in. So it worked out. But that was just a small world. And of course, if you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel, I might do it again. Not right now. <sighs> it's my turn to Where, whoa. Ha <laughs> ha. Now you're in trouble. Well, now I don't know how to fix that. Sorry. Sorry. Where are they at? Captain Crunch or somebody's here. Can you un unhide monks? I would to turn my screen brightness up. Yes, you know who I'm talking about. We have to come over here. I'll have to go through the list. So they turn the screen up. There we go. Uh, oh my. <laughs>
I'll have to do this on my computer. All right, well. Um, I think I'm the only one on today. So I'll have to fix that later, monks. Uh, sorry about that. That's my fault. <coughs> you, you can still watch. You just can't chat at the moment. I'll have to get on my computer and find your name and fix it. We're going to catch Dapper Dan's now as we got to get towards Main Street for the 220 Dapper Dan's will end a couple minutes later. The bands will come by. Then, uh, yeah, it all moves pretty quickly. Yeah, thank, thank you. I, I'm sorry about that. I didn't mean to. I, I'll get it fixed when I get home. Sorry about that. Thanks for understanding. See, uh, I can moderate and everything, but when the the problem with the S23, I only say this because I now have an S24. The screen brightness. On you guys can clearly see the screen on that one, right? The 24. If there's any kind of like smudge or anything on it, you can't read it. So I'm like trying to. And yeah, that's that's my bad. Um, and then another person said, Jason, I'm gonna answer this one. Yeah, it's all good, Cap, I can answer this one. They said, might take some heat for this, but why do live streamers feel the need to constantly sing and make noise? Just let the uh, enjoy the ambience of the parks and rides. Well, if you want that, there are a ton of videos of people who posted uh, where it's just the music and the ambience of the background. The reason we sing the songs and everything all the time, and I know this one, is because we're here a lot. And while we're here, we tend to sing the songs and enjoy the park, right? I'm not just here in live streaming, I enjoy being here. So yes, I'm gonna sing along, I'm gonna enjoy it. I know it's hard for a lot of people who watch to have someone, but like again, it's you don't have to watch me. Again, I, I know a lot of people don't watch me because I sing along and do these things, but at the same time, there are others out there. 
I don't do anything during the rides, during the parades, during anything like that. I know a lot of people like to talk and yell at all the characters and everything. I don't do that because um, that also takes away from the ability of the, like the little kid next to me who's trying to enjoy the parade and wants Grumpy to, or uh, Snow White or somebody like that. I don't. Just pick a character. I don't care. Um, like, that was really nice. I'm sorry. I really like this piece. <laughs> so that's why. We're here live. We're going to hum to the songs that are... If you want the ambiance, there's ambiance videos all over the internet. This is not a place. Live streamers talk because that's why they, people watch live streaming. They want the interaction. They want the conversations. Where did he vanish to? Oh, okay. It's like, why are you running? Oh my gosh, I got... Who? Uh, torch? Furnace? Yeah, he's here. Yeah, he's downstairs. Charlie's here. Yeah. We made a pumpkin earlier. Jason? No. Charlie. Jason, still supposed to be here? No. That's not supposed to be here. Oh, that's right. He's supposed to be here. Charlie's the only one I've seen come in. Yeah, that was good. Just a everybody. I have that mind in my You want me? Um, he said, hold on a second, everybody. I was like, oh my um, um, that company. Okay. Yeah. I got that Like, uh, okay. I thought he was like a hot boy tonight. I'm good. No, I'm good for about a month. <laughs> well, I'm going to use it if I got it. Alright. Hi, Giselle. I'm just joking. I said hi, Giselle. I said Giselle at first and I realized I was wrong. I'm sorry. I'm. How's your day? I thought it was Monday when I started today. Okay, okay. I'm like over here going, wait, is it Monday again? If you come to the... And when I'm here every day for a week, it, it, I'm here tomorrow night. Of course. I love the people mover. Not people mover today, though. We did Small World just now. I don't, it was the only walk on I could do. Huh? Oh gosh, no, that's like 15 minutes. 15? No, no, 15, I'd go poo. I go poo. <laughs> she made me say it. She said 15, I'll go poo. Oh man, she got me. So yeah. Anyway, that's all the whole thing about live streaming and uh, why we sing along with everything. I know a lot of people don't like it. Not one, my voice isn't very good for singing. Totally agree with you. Um, another reason people don't like live is like they want the ambiance of the uh, the park. But again, like I said, I, I can name off a ton of different. I, mean, I think what Josh has like several like ten hour long stream uh, videos of ambiance of the park where you're just walking around and you just hear the noises. So <laughs> I'm not gonna stop singing. Again, two things. You can hit that dislike button because you didn't like something you saw here. You can hit that like button if you did like something out here. These are both options there. Uh, and then number two, uh, subscribe so you can come back and dislike it again. Voice of an angel. <laughs> have you seen, or not seen, have you heard Toda sing Wondrous Journeys? <laughs> that was so funny the other night. I was having the best time with that. Oh, no, I'm fine, Yvonne. 
People have questions. You should be able to answer these questions. You shouldn't get angry at somebody asking you why you sing all the time. They're asking, they're being curious. Why do we do that? Why do we, don't, don't make enemies out of people. Answer their questions. So, they're not the villain. They're not. They're not being. Rude. And Lily asked, and they asked too. It's not like they were being like mean about it. They're like, "Why do live streamers sing?" I can put my sunglasses on. <laughs> Move! The Austin Power scene right there. That's what I was just going with. <laughs> Get out of the way! I would watch. No, I'm done. I'm leaving at the same time I do every day, 3.30.
another song. It's actually a romantic tune entitled They Can Lock Me Up For Loving You, But They Can't Keep My Face From Breaking Out. Oh. It's a pop tune. Nice. No. About my name's Queen. No. All right, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. How about we sing one of my favorite love songs as well instead? Kiss me in the no, well. <laughs> We waited all that time for that. <laughs> We're not going to circle with that. Let me show you how to show oh. Don't go anywhere, you're not alone. This is next song. It's a tragic love song. It goes by the title, She Left Me Because I'm Bald. I told her it's hair loss. <laughs> I'm going to go just as well as I do. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you said we're going to show us how you how it's done. He showed us how to blind the audience. That's right. That's right. Put that back on. <laughs> All right, I think it's time that we should reintroduce ourselves. Oh, right? yeah. My name is Eric, and I sing the lead parts. Woo! Thank you. Thank That's you. right. Yes, yes, thank you. This is Kevin. He's in the tenor part. Yay! Yay. Right. Yeah, not too bad. All right. This is Roy. He sings the baritone. Woo. All right, so, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, once in a lifetime, a great bass singer comes along like none other. Well, thank you, Bert. And until that time, we have John over here. A hand for John. Thank you. All right. Now, yeah. okay. now, John's been working on a bass solo. Those are very rare, folks. Uh, maybe for good reason. Uh, we're going to find out. Here we go. All right. Somebody stole my guy. Somebody stole my Somebody stole my Somebody says that, but it's in beer, touching beer, so church bells will sweetly ring, swing, tingling, tingling, somebody, somebody knows that, somebody, somebody knows that, I love somebody, and somebody knows, somebody stole my, somebody stole my, somebody stole my, somebody somebody stole my, somebody came and took her away, she didn't even say she was leaving, her kisses I love. Oh! 
Why? Because she kept running away from the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Some dapper dance. Oh, oh, 
nice. Well, the ha ha we parted in the show now, that was great. <laughs> no, it was, it was it. That, that was just purely uh, yeah, organic. Yeah, you're right. Hey, minus. Yeah, oh, wow. Yeah, wow. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. But it's in time for the fireworks, too. Well, that was the Dapper Dans, everybody. I hope you guys are enjoying today's stream here. It's a very beautiful Magic Kingdom. Temperatures, wonderful. Views, beautiful. The park, looking great today. And they're finishing up the song right now, and then we'll get some fireworks. They're just about to start singing the home part. We got 16 homes to fireworks. <laughs> I saw an Epcot 30th shirt. That was cool. That's a good spot. Where's Mickey and Minnie? Okay, they're on their left hand side. Hold on. And Three, two, one, Mickey and Minnie's coming over. Walking up. Magic feels like home. And three, two, one, fireworks. Jazz hands. Bam. Nailed it. <laughs> Friends and new. Real soon. Woo! There we go. Look at this. This is just empty. I knew this was going to happen. Witchcraft. How do I do it? I'm here a lot. <laughs> Just like the cast members, they can do it too. Oh, I didn't switch. Why does it still say back camera on it? Did I not do that or was that this phone? I don't know. Now I gotta look at it. Stand by. Now I gotta watch my own stream again. Hold on. That's so weird. Last night everything was in reverse, but today it's fine. Maybe it's depending on how you start the stream. Oh, man, that feels good in here. This is Miguel. Miguel's currently making some pirate ships. I don't know what he's making now, but he has some pirate ships. He All right, two minutes to step off for the bands out of the uh, frontier land. So there's two, I think there's two bands today, from what I can see, worth, worth the people earlier. Um, marching bands, like school bands and stuff. We have a bunch of parents probably wa uh, watching and uh, gonna wanna see that, so they're on the way. Oh, the w weather today is great. I also like timing and stuff, so like, if you haven't noticed, like during the the parade, like when the Peter Pan float shoots the cannons, it would be like, tch, tch, tch. like it was usually on reverse, right? So, tch, tch, tch. I like to do steps, stuff like that. I like to do camera things. This one's a 125 pumpkin, for those who are wondering. That's how much that would cost you if you were to buy this pumpkin. One twenty-five. It's got a cool black stem on it and everything. That was the black stem he was working on earlier. Woo! 
no puzzle. Second puzzle. This one's a 75 pumpkin. I mean, I like, are you shaking? Like, are we still having aftershocks or like you just shaking from earlier? Let's head over to, um, yeah, we got a couple minutes. We can make it over to Town Square. No, not Town Square, um, Liberty Square. The 16 lands of the Magic Kingdom. Woo, almost fell over. I almost missed that. Yes, the 125 pumpkin is the same size as the not so scary pumpkin. Oh, shaking from there, oh, gotcha. I wasn't sure if you had aftershocks. Like in Japan, we have aftershocks for like a while. A while. Uh, that's the uh, Crystal Art Store on Main Street. Okay, so no small aftershocks. Got it. If the aftershocks were still close to like the original number, then then I'd be more like that's just settling. A lot of uh, people I know eat at the Christmas house. The churro waffle. The, the churro Mickey waffle. Yes, of course, you can always come by and say hi to me. Absolutely. We meet people every day. Again, a lot of people don't want to be on stream, so they'll approach me from the side of the camera so they don't have to be on. If you guys want to, of course, just ask. We'll show you. Oh, shoot, we got to hurry up. I just heard them make the announcement. They stepped off early. Meow. I mean, I didn't step off early, but like. Monkey fixture account. I hear the other band already. Much louder. Yeah. All right. Oh, 
c'est... Euh... All right, there we go. Okay, we're back. Not the Philharmonic, right? Uh, I don't believe so. Okay. Yeah. I think they have Fridays off. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now everything's working correctly. Eh. Good to see you, Beck. Beck, good to have you, David D. Welcome, Sheila. Loves Disney. Good to see you. Um, let's see. Yes. I guess there's one more on the way. I, I, I thought there was two. I guess there's three. So one more on the way. Uh, Fridays, Philharmonic's usually off. Yep, I can hear him now. Oh yeah, don't go under ropes. I feel so bad for this kid clothesline that so so bad earlier today. You see a lot of kids getting out. Where was it over here? No, monorail. Oh. Just got off the monorail. What a good way to start the day. No. Have a good day so far? Oh yeah. No, the weather's great. Oh my god. <laughs> I know, I'm, and then it's like low crowds compared to the last couple days. Only, only for park hopping. So if you still had a ticket for the park, you were still able to come in, but uh, you couldn't like park hop. Yeah, I don't work yesterday, so I. Oh, um, I came here on Christmas. It was worse. Oh really? Yeah. I would say yesterday was worse than Christmas, and I was here. <laughs> for both <laughs> so it was really sporadic though people were moving in weird patterns so like a whole area would just be empty all of a sudden because everybody would see the low wait time somewhere else okay, and chase yeah. them yeah I work at Mansion too and it's usually either super congested over there yes. and you can't walk there it's like yes and then it's a breeze yeah no when I walked by Mansion earlier the lightning lane was back by Harbor House and you're just like what you work with Emily Okay. Uh, the Hall of Presidents caused uh, political problems, not copyrights or anything. People say they won't, but they always do. No, there's no copyrights to Hall of Presidents. There's actually zero. Um, and then there's no, uh, yeah. They start naming off all the presidents and then, you know, how people get about that.
ride. I cut my foot on the lake and had to. Whew. Yeah, I know. I know. I, I when I'm not live streaming, I go watch the Hall of Presidents. I don't think anything wrong. I just watch it, enjoy it. If you watch Hall of Presidents enough, though, eventually you'll be able to name off every president. It's kind of like anything else that we do here, right? We can sing the entire song to the tiki room and all those different things. All uh, right, yeah, no problem. Sorry about that earlier, but we got you all fixed. I was watching the dance. I was able to have somebody help us out and get it fixed. Hot dog, what's going on? <laughs> Hot dog! Oh. So I'm actually on my way somewhere right now. Oh, there we go. There's Wendell. Hey Wendell, you got a moment for a photo? You do? You're the best. Awesome. Thank you so much, Wendell. I got a photo with Wendell. I'm pretty excited about today now. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> no, 3.35 after, or 3.30 after leave. I know what time I gotta leave, everybody. Don't worry. I've only been doing it every day for like a year now. No, I don't put myself in thumbnails. I tried that once. Awkward. Then it's not about the park, it's about me. So I don't put myself in any of my thumbnails if you haven't noticed. That's, the, that's for me, that's going on my background on my computer at home. Now, if you do see me put myself in something, that's usually like when, like when we were at home yesterday with Shelly, Um, like when I'm with Shelly, then we, you know, that's different, right? We're, we're focusing on what we're doing there. That's, that's us. I try to keep it very specific to, uh, what we're doing. Hi Caleb, say hi to Chippendale. Let's see, we got three th uh, no, so I, I usually, like, it's not 3.30, it's like whenever the parade comes by and then I gotta get going, but I get home, I make sure I have extra time by the time I get there to deal with, you know, anything that happens, any traffic or anything. Like, we honestly, like, any other park, we wouldn't have to worry about it so much, right? Because you don't have to travel all...
<laughs> yeah. No, she'll think it's adorable. No. Oh yes, my wife did her little t-shirt video the other day. She's she's trying, she's still learning. It's like, you know, when you, you're learning something. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, good to see you. Oh, no, the cricket is definitely a, for a while there, the cricket kept cutting off um, in a, like a, a weird pattern. Oh no, not in June. June's too close to closing of the ride. The problem is when a ride gets close to closing, um, the uh, the ride gets very popular, more than usual. We have to do it sooner than that. I don't know. I don't have a date yet. Uh, I think somebody said the 17th. I have to double check myself on that. Um. Man, the sun is kicking my butt right now. Woo. There we go. Unfortunately, my spot is not going to be my... We're going to have to modify this location. We can do it in the morning, we can't do it in the evening now, or the, the second parade. Because normally we have this shiny tree. Yeah, the big old tree right here usually blocks it. No, it's just, yeah, it's hot now.
two boots right here also for you. Oh, okay, gotcha. Um, well, I have some bad news, Beethoma. Kevin's not here anymore. Let's see who else we got here. Okay, so yeah, 17. So we're gonna have to do it much sooner. Oh, awesome. Good to hear, Beach Home. There's something about this spot that everybody stops right in front of it. Denzanito honeymoons in September. A couple hot days in March, but not overall pretty good. And John for Disney has gifted a membership. Thank you so much, John for Disney. Going out there. Brianna L, thank you so much. And congratulations, Brianna L. That's my girl. She's so cute. See who else we got here. No. Bob G. said if you want a good spot. Is that my dude Coda? 
What's going on, Coda? 499 from Justin B says, Ron, my wife and I met you one year ago today at the Magic Kingdom. No way. Let's see who else we got here. I can barely. What is going on with this thing? There we go. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, everybody. You got a moment. Subscribe to the channel. It's free to do. I just got a photo with Wendell a minute ago. Let me find that photo again. Check that out, everybody. I got a Wendell photo. <laughs> Hey, we got a new brand. Thank you so much for joining the channel. I'm not famous in any way. I'm just Ron. Normal guy. Check it out, everybody. Woo! What a craziness. And of course, down in the description below, enter yourself a chance to win some free stuff. That's right, everybody. You can enter and win the free stuff. We have a giveaway going on 32,500 subscribers. Click a link, enter a name, enter an address, and uh, <laughs> Uh, click that link. You don't need to be subscribed to the channel. You could just be watching because you want to see the parade. And uh, yeah, that's, that's it. It's pretty simple. You can click on a uh, website and an Instagram. Uh, if you don't have Instagram, just open it. It's going to open a window. You can close it. It'll give you that entry either way. You don't have to have Instagram, right? Because you're not liking the channel. You're not subscribed or whatever you want to call it, right? And you're just going to it and leaving. Well, one and all the Magic Kingdom. In just a few minutes, we will proudly present an enchanting celebration in the streets. In the streets! Our Disney Festival of Fantasy Parade. But first, please welcome our honorary Grand Marshals, the Alvarado family from Long Island, New York, celebrating Kaylee's 15th birthday and ah, Kaylee's first birthday. Show nails back. What's, ow, 
close my fingers. What? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There it is. Hold on a second. What do you mean Janelle's on? I don't see no Janelle. I see Janelle tomorrow. Or is she on TikTok? I'm as a chair talker. Beach home, I don't see no Janelle anywhere. Oh, that looks so good. <laughs> oh no, so YouTube has been messing up real bad lately. Um, so last night um, I had somebody message me saying, hey, I know it's like almost one in the morning and I know Shelly isn't awake um, or something like that. I can't forget what time it was last night. Hold on, I'll look at it. We ended our stream at 9.30. They messaged us at 10 o'clock saying, hey, we just got a notification that you went live. So it's YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, I know, Coda. It's super weird. Sometimes you get a notification. Like, Shelly got a notification. We went live. The moment we went live yesterday. Um, at the house. And then got another notification. Yeah, it's weird. It's weird. <laughs> it's a new feature yeah well what it does actually though it does tell people like hey you yeah, might have missed this stream and yeah but now i get people in the comment section trying to talk like they're talking to me but unfortunately the stream is over so now i get messages like so what's the shirt of the day and it's like i can't show you the shirt the stream's over what do you mean shirt of the day by the way shirt of the day It, it's, I feel like it's turning into the lucky shirt. Let's see, how many more friends do we get before the parade starts? All right, we got another one. It takes one. That, uh, that's something that World of Color says. You know, today's been a good day. It was, I wore it, and as soon as we got removed from uh, Big Thunder Mountain, I was like, it's going to be one of those days. Oh, man, World of Color is so cool. I can't wait till we get... Um, I'm hoping that we get World of Color 2 out here 
and they turn Animal Kingdom into like World of Color 2 Lagoon or something like that. Maybe, maybe Animal Kingdom can do some kind of cool thing like that. There, there's no, no, that earthquake was way too far away and it's only 4.8. So, I know, I know like a lot of people there, 4.8 is a lot there, but like distance wise, no. If we were to experience anything, it need to be up in the 7-8 range to travel that and have an effect down here. Wool the Thriller has gifted, or Angela has gifted five memberships going out to Casey, Chris, Anthony, Bob G, and Will the Thriller. Thank you so much, uh, Angela. Greatly appreciate it. Um, and of course, if you guys are looking for your travel advisor, Angela, the gifting membership lady, uh, can help you not book that cruise. How about that? She'll help you book any cruise but that cruise. But she'll book you tickets to here so you can go board that cruise. Uh, subscribers are people who watch the channel and uh, or not and uh, <laughs> who do that that's free membership I will personally tear every bolt out of the boat when they recycle it free of charge um, <laughs> uh, memberships are the, it's, a, it's a monthly cost or a one time cost it was up to you and uh, it supports the channel in a financial way. Come on, phone.
<laughs> Maybe the boat needs a paint job. <laughs> Watch it endlessly burn. It's my greatest enemy at the park. The boat. Cord, not coward, cord, got you. Finder, but don't worry about that. I don't know why I know that.
I'm having a tea party. Well, everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed the parade. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It's free to do. Free to do. Man, what a not too busy day. Got a little warm in that sunlight over there. But uh, overall, it's been a pretty nice day. We still want to ride in Big Thunder Mountain, even though we got removed off the ride earlier today. But still got it done. Little pirates. Some small world, some parades, Grayson, Dapper Dan's, Pumpkin was made in glass shop. Watch some bands. Yeah, you know, it's been a good day. Let's see. Who is on? Where are we going? Oh, we're trying to catch this. Yeah. Well, oh, you right. having a little tea party over there? Yeah. A little mid mid midday tea party, huh? That's right. Curiosity. Yeah. Sanity. Yeah. You got plenty of time. They're just making Main Street right now. Oh, okay. Hold on, I'll get through it. There you go. I got you. Oh, yeah. Well, Main Street down at the end is going to be pretty open. Tip Sawyer, tip. <laughs> Cap, you still talk. I love how you put like my name in there. You're like Ron tipped. <laughs> if you would have pushed me during the turn and burn out of the Fantasmic show, yeah, you definitely would have tipped me over. <laughs> Please. 
Oh, hi, how are you doing? It's your homies. Two, one, around your back. Thank you. There we go. Plenty of space. There you go. This is where you watch the parade from, is yeah. Oh, I broke my glass. Oh man. I was wondering why my glasses fit weird. Sorry, I was guiding some people through the uh, the double parade route there. But everybody, that's it for me today. I have to go home. I got things to do, places to be, and uh, I'll see y'all tomorrow night uh, as we take Saturdays off. We go swimming with the kids tomorrow. We're gonna go to the pool and stuff. So if you guys enjoyed today's stream here at the Magic Kingdom, don't forget to hit that like button. Let us know you enjoyed it. Of course, subscribe to the channel. Love the support. Free to do. I want to thank all my Patreon members, channel members for all the continued support. My moderators for moderating, and my wonderful wife for just working when she's working and working when she's not working. She's very busy. And if you guys are looking to book your next trip, check out Travel with Angela down in the description below. They are here, she is here to help you book that next trip to wherever you want to go and maybe get you a good discount. Maybe not, I don't know. Talk to her, she's the, she's the expert, not me. And again, I want to thank my moderators for dealing with me. Bye, Bye. you too. As uh, I am on every day, so they cannot be here every day. And, uh, but they're always in the background, they're, they're lurking. All right. Well, looks like we missed our monorail. So. Ugh. Bummer I missed it. Like, like, like that much. All right, everybody. Have a wonderful night, evening. I'm going to see you guys tomorrow back here at Magic Kingdom. 845 fireworks tomorrow night. Like I said, Shelly works on Saturdays, so I spend my whole day with the kids. We do kid things. We go to the pool. And, yeah, we'll see you all tomorrow.